Hello and welcome back to my let's play of Persona 5 New Game Plus. We are back in school and we're going to be working through the next couple of days with the main idea being that we want to delay entering the palace for the second time until we can refresh our stock of items and all that sort of stuff. So that means uh, we'll wait until Monday. Monday is the first day that we can get back like our SP replenishing items, things like that. And for now, we're going to concentrate on doing some more confidant links and we can, thankfully, we actually um, will gain, um, s later on today, we'll gain the ability to be a lot more free with that uh, in mind. And I'll explain that now because actually um, once we sort of start the confidant links, there's not an awful lot of time for me, you know, there's not a lot of free time for me to actually be able to talk to you guys. So today the plan is to talk to Takimi and take our death confidant link another rank up. Again, improving her confidant link means that we continually get um, we're improving the stock of healing items that she has at her store. And also, um, we're going to be progressing Sojiro's confidant link, um, which will allow us to brew coffee at in LeBlanc when uh, there are no customers around. And brewing coffee is actually really useful in this game because LeBlanc coffee is uh, an SP replenishing item and it's a lot better than the sort of the drinks that we've been using a lot so far. So there's definitely benefits to both and we'll be uh, making the most of that as we progress onwards with the game. Uh, we'll talk a bit more about the coffee when we actually do some coffee brewing. Um, there's a little there are some little quirks with regards to that that we can definitely talk through. The other thing I wanted to um, mention certainly for now is because it's a Friday, that means that we can go to the school store and buy yakisoba pan, um, uh, which is another example of the items, the various items throughout the game that are only available in certain circumstances. Be that items that are only available in spring, such as the Earth Burger and what do you want? the spring. I can't remember exactly what it's called, but there's like a spring pack at the Yongan Jaya supermarket that you can also buy, but obviously only in spring. Then you have items uh, like the yakisoba pan, which, is, which are only available on certain days. Another one um, which we will uh, get into, but. Uh, yeah, but we'll get into more is the um, is the fruit juices that are available in the Shibuya Underground Mall. And then on top of all of that, we have the uh, items that are only available during certain weathers. So you also have items that are only available when it's raining. Um, in particular, I think raining is the main one. Um, and so you yeah, have yeah, a wide variety of different things. And as always, with me being um, very much a kind of completionist sort of nature, we're going to do our utmost to try and make sure that we see everything that we can in that regard, see most of these items, potentially try and use most of these items. Um, as always, the consumables, the difficulty with JRPGs and consumables I usually find is that the day to day, you know, the, the basic matters against MOOCs is are too easy and using consumables is um, Please just head a to waste. The exam room. And then the bastards against the bottle uh, against the boss battles are actually okay. often so Which hard one? that spending a time to use a consumable is is quite dangerous. But anyway, that is Why gonna be it for this episode. I hope you have enjoyed it and I hope you'll oh, join me on the next. Here you go. You want that one? Thanks. Take care. Head to the exam room. Hmm.
What? By the way. Take care. Ah, you're back. Ha! <laughs> 
All right. <laughs> 